don't tell your partner and then suddenly she just checks your phone why would she check my phone <laughs> because that's what girlfriends do no <laughs> oh my no, god no 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 all girls not, not all, girls. all girls do no, that no, no. not all girls <laughs> Yo! Hafiz and RG. Hi, my name is Hafiz. I am the eighth member of BTS. <laughs> but I've been on radio for I think a good 11 years, man. I'm old! I'm gonna get It's gold! <laughs> That's right. Uh, I'm RD. I've been on radio for 10 years. Uh, this is my first time with the girls from Likely. I'm so excited. <laughs> Bathroom. Yeah, they're in their bathrooms. We're, bathroom. we're making ourselves comfortable. Well, y'all right? yeah. said hotel, so I got dibs on this bathroom. How's your dating life like? Oh, non-existent. <laughs> Lies. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I hardly date. You look like you're someone who probably date around. Maybe that's why I don't go on dates because everybody assumes <laughs> that I'm always that. going around. No, 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 no. Ardi's a one date kind of guy. Yeah. Because he has uh, his standards are so high. After a date, usually he'll be like. Turned yeah. out like a girl. Uh -huh. Kind of, kind of. Well, Hafiz knows my history of all the women I've yeah. kind of dated, so that's probably why I have not really high, I wouldn't say high standards, I have a checklist. Okay. It's not that thing so himself. if it doesn't Your go. Okay. I'm not realistic. No, no, no. Mine are pretty realistic. Yeah. Wait, do you want to know what my checklist yeah. is? Sure, okay. why not? Top so five. maybe, maybe Top like five. girls who are interested. <laughs> okay. Y'all want to, you know, like listen to this. Okay, you must love animals, you must love nature, you must be eco friendly. You must treat people with respect. And the last one is, you must treat me with respect too. Okay, mm. and what okay. about you, Hafiz? Yeah. I'm kind of seeing someone. Ooh. Okay. But it's still new, so I don't want to jinx it. You should follow my checklist. <laughs> I don't checklist. want to have a checklist, man. It's Why? dangerous. It's yeah, not. It's so dangerous. Because if is the it? girl does not fit in one criteria, it'll be like, okay, I Like it all just yeah. falls out. When she has other so good much? things. Well, you know? of course, I, I would think about the other good things. I always make the pros and cons and yeah. whatnot. Pros you know? And cons. Actually, you have pros and cons. Yes. No, I would just date. I, <laughs> I like you. I eventually, like you. <laughs> it's like, you know? It's so simple for Grace. I wish I was like her. Today's topic is Should you share everything with your partner? Ooh. So, this is our first episode with boys. So, we're excited to see a different viewpoint. The first question is Do you guys share everything with your partner? I'll just go first. <laughs> <laughs> I would say. Um, 85 percent what's the other okay example let's see la. okay if you're dating someone and then one of your sisters does not like your partner uh, okay i right. wouldn't share that with my partner don't you think it's, it's mm. good if you tell them so they know what to do when they see your sister i will give information not the whole information maybe just chunks and pieces right so how would you tell i would say like hey we're gonna see my sister later maybe dot 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 i don't know <laughs> okay, wait. Yeah, so maybe so, like don't do this yes, or yeah. yeah so i see like I'll so you're up. you're afraid of confrontation between yes. family and the person it that has you're happened dating before okay my okay my mom and my former partner i didn't like that okay mm. so can i ask you girls if you were in that situation let's say liana you were dating hafiz and all that and his sister did not like you would would you confront or would you confront just confront the sister? Would you confront the sister as to why you don't like me or just kind of be very mean or just be very cold no, to them? Or just I, like, you know, what Or ignore. Yeah, ignore. I I wouldn't want to be cold because maybe that information shouldn't have like unless the sister actually wants me to know that she right. doesn't like me, but if she's just informing, you know, half is Okay. Then yeah, because it might be awkward if you did know, right? Yeah. You would not know how to react. react yeah, yeah. So. Really? Because I would ask the I person. I would want to know. I would want right? to know, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's like... Know why. why are you having beef with me when I'm just... Or I'll maybe I... try to like, you know, get closer to her actually. Yeah, see? Yeah. Like, so you want to... Like yeah. <laughs> okay, not that not way. Way. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but would you share everything with your partner? Um, so in the past, I did not. Okay. Out of fear, uh, it's mostly out of fear right. of being judged and, and, and whatnot. Now I do. I just kind of lay everything on the table and if you like it, you like it. If you don't like it, then that's okay. I still respect you. You respect me, but I move on with my life. What if you, you've said everything too early? Mm. Is there like a thing? Do you guys I don't think so. That? Well, let me tell you a story about one of the girls that I used to date. So she used to, she used to keep things from me. Because out of fear as well that I might judge her, basically what the things that she kept from me was, um, you know, the guy she dated. So I would meet these people not knowing oh, who they are, dated. that oh. she's dated them, and only after I shook their hand 
and they left, they were like, oh, by the way, I dated him. Then I'm like, why didn't you tell me that? I mean, it doesn't really matter to me who you date, but it's it's nice to know that you're still honest about it because now yeah. you have this distrust. Yeah, you know? because it's like hiding something. Yeah, yeah. exactly. But, but she did mention it to you right after the meet. Exactly. But so it would have would, been better before. It would have been better because I don't like by the way girls. Ah, uh, you know? I don't, I don't like by the way people. Either. Yeah, see? <laughs> but did you ask her when you guys like were dating like first? Like yes. The first date. Yes. So we had that talk where, like, hey, you know, like, what's uh, your history? Who, what's your history like? And I'll tell you my history. Really? Is that important to share history? Yeah. Uh, it's nice. Okay, yeah. It's very, <laughs> very important. Okay. Yeah, I know. So. <laughs> um, I don't think it's important. Okay. Unless if you are bound to meet your ex, let's say we're going to an event, then you give the heads up that like, you know what, my ex might be there. I agree with that. Okay. Yeah, yes. But yeah. So I don't you think, think it's important. No, I don't think you need to know that person's history because if, for example, if that person dated someone like who's way better than you, like physically, yeah. looks, it might be intimidating for you and it might <clears throat> affect you, you might be insecure and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So for me, yeah, I it's guess. not important. Yeah, it's not about the names. It's more about how they treated you and how they made you feel. So I know how to take care of you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Understanding your past yeah. to learn yeah. the lesson That's, that's better, yeah. what's most important. Do you guys think complete honesty will bring you and your partner closer? Yes. If you are really are a team as a couple, then you want to help each other out. And the only way to do that is by being completely honest with them. What are the things that we shouldn't have to be completely honest about? Okay, let's, uh, one example, let's say someone messages you on Instagram. She's right. like, yeah, Hafiz, I love you so much, <laughs> you know? You're so good looking, you know, stuff like that. Okay. Would you want to share it with your partner? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I, mean, no, I just it avoid it. It's not that I respond to this. Yeah, people, if you don't respond, then you don't need Yeah. So only if you respond, then only yeah. you share. <laughs> if you choose to respond. Well, how do you respond? It's how exactly. you respond. If you don't, then it's okay. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. So, what if, okay, let's say you don't tell your partner, and then suddenly she just checks your phone. Why would she check my phone? Because that's what girlfriends do. No, <laughs> oh my God. no, 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 no. Not all girls, not all, not all girls. girls do no, that. No. Not all girls. <laughs> now we know what Are Grace yours? is all about. Diana, do you agree wow. with this? No, I don't like. Just, that's why I, <laughs> complete honesty is important. So I think if you don't yeah, respond, it's fine. Okay. okay. But if you choose to respond, like if you were to find out somehow, yeah. Like, well, like, when hey, was this? Why? Why, exactly why are you responding? So many questions. Yeah. Yeah. And if you have nothing to hide from your girlfriend, why? Yeah. You don't need to lock your phones. <laughs> that's one. But if you have nothing to oh, hide, why not just it. tell? <laughs> Give me a top five of what you should share and what you should not share. I think you should share your feelings. Okay. It's very, very... <laughs> no, he is a very sensitive guy. I'm, I'm very sensitive. I vibe like so hard. You have no idea. <laughs> Okay. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. <laughs> <laughs> so I think guys have a very tough time talking about their, their feelings. And they always give generic answers. Do you girls realize that? Yeah. Like what? It's like, oh, like why are you so angry? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But, the, but sometimes it's actually hard for guys to actually formulate the words yeah. as to why they are so upset about things because they don't know where it's coming from sometimes. Because they're not they emotionally intelligent. From? It could be from a past uh, experience or okay. it could be where they're just so angry of something that you did maybe two months ago, but they just kind of save it. They save the emotion. For something else. I thought that's what girls do. Yeah. Oh no no! Really? This, I thought this is girls really. just like. Oh, this is, we would uh, let it out, and then we have stages. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh wow. But if something triggers it, yeah, then we'll bring it up again. <laughs> exactly. Remember what you did five months ago? <laughs> <laughs> Share food, you have to. What else? Hafiz, can we, Hafiz and I join? Uh, okay. <laughs> it's, yeah, sure, it's fine, yeah. Because we're thinking more in the sense of health. Say so maybe you can. Anxiety? Yeah, anxiety, or you have been Yeah, or depression. Or, oh, yeah, yeah, I totally agree. You should share you share that with us. That's what I was uh, mentioning to you about now. Now I'm just completely open about everything. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I got anxiety issues, I got depression. You know, this is me, and that's, Take it that's leave right. It. Yeah, Take it leave exactly, it. yeah. Should we share bank accounts? No? Yes. Yeah, so that's yes. a. Depends on how but long you're I dating. I share the guy's bank account, but he doesn't share mine. <laughs> That's why I know. That's different. Have another account, no. share that one, okay? <laughs> Could be the reason why no one's sliding into your DMs, Chris. <laughs> okay, but what about if you, like you said just now, if you don't like your partner's family member or yeah. friends, uh -huh. should you share that? Personally, I would. It's like, oh, my mom thinks that you're not good for me. Oh. Yeah. Oh, but really? I would. I would. Oh. Yeah, I know. I would tell them that, but I said, but you know what? But that's my mom's opinion. 
I still I like want to be with you. Mm. Okay. So you have to always give a reassurance. If you can, I always say this, if you're going to give a problem, give a solution. Yeah. Okay, anything else that you think you shouldn't share? Yeah, what about your cheating history? Oh. If you have to. Oh, oh, yes! Ooh. Yeah. Cheating, okay, calm down, Grace. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if, if, they, if they don't ask. Well, should I share? Yeah, I, when you share the thing. I would say no, this. You should be honest because you'll be like, you know, babe, I need you to know this. I've this has happened before. In the past, yeah. But I'm a changed man now. If you are. <laughs> you see, that's how do you? How are you going to believe him when you say that already? You already yeah. have but that already. But then now that. you're saying that you. you but the fact that you want to disclose, yeah. A real relationship now. All right. I would say that it it's 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 okay to to share your cheating history. Only if it means it's gonna benefit your relationship in the future. Right. Yeah. If it doesn't, and I'll give you an example of how it doesn't. If you just want to find out to accuse him or accuse her of something, so he can back himself up. And back or, himself up. Yeah. You see, I told you. You see, you're like once a cheater, always a cheater. Uh, it no, doesn't work no, that way. No, that's not. You know? Yeah. yeah. But so, I guess in the sense of trying to understand your past, like you said, just yeah. Now, yeah. So Hafiz and Ardi. Mm. Yes. When do you think is the right time to open up about your stuff? Well. You should open up about everything since the beginning. But so first date? No, nah, uh, maybe third date when third. you're about to no. become official. But well, it takes three dates to become official. <laughs> oh, that's a bit fast. Perfect, guys. Well, that's you haven't dated that me, that's why you own now. <laughs> well, oh man, it takes me. I'm I'm a very I'm a turtle. I would say after like maybe three months of dating. <laughs> okay. Yeah, is that too long? I don't what? know. Three months. Because I need to. Gone up no, no. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, sometimes you don't want to overshare because the girl might yeah, think, oh my god, like, you're oh. doing too much. Get frightened by that. Yeah. I think it like, depends on the, it's yeah. not just the time span, it's the frequency. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's the frequency. Like, it's, are we going to make it a habit for the next few months? Because I think everybody should appreciate how much time they, they have in their lives. Mm. So your time is very, very precious. So if I'm going to spend the next three months with you... So wait, three months, you're already boyfriend and girlfriend? No, dating. Long. It's long, yeah, because um, long. it's not that well, long. Hafiz knows yeah. this, but in my all my twenties, I've never, I've never really dated. I've just been in relationships, like long relationships, long relationships. like long, okay. long relationships, <laughs> <laughs> long. Okay, I just want to say that I think if you are in a stable relationship, it shouldn't matter even if you are checking somebody else's out, because then you'll just feel like, wait, don't you think like she's hot? And then mm. the girlfriend will also be like, yo, oh my god, she's hot. I mean. If she's cool enough. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. mean that like, if you are stable enough, yeah. then if you wouldn't stable feel enough, yes. intimidated by it. Yeah, you know? shouldn't, you shouldn't. And you would do the same to your boyfriend. Yeah, that's because true. there yeah. will be prettier or more handsome, handsome people. people. Yeah, yeah, that's just Exactly, like, yeah. It's all attention. about making that person feel safe. Yeah. yeah. I dated a girl like that carried a knife. <laughs> so she could slice you. Yeah, slice into my DMs. <laughs> 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 I don't know what this is now. <laughs> so, that's all. Wow. Well, <laughs> wasn't that awkward? <laughs> yeah. What an awkward ending. We will not have boys anymore. Helene, you can edit, right? <laughs> <laughs>